Hi guys, my name is Alicia and I'm with the Zany Moment. So I wanted to continue my series on chakra balancing. So last week I did um, the root, so I wanted to do the sacral. So what I typically work with is when I have my clients, I activate all 12 of their chakras. But in this session, I'm only going to do the six. I'm not going to activate your third eye um, and, or your high heart either. Okay, that's, that's up to you guys. The high heart is anyways. If you book a session, then yes, you will get all 12 activated, including your third eye. But for today, we're going to do the sacral. So, um, I have some very exciting news coming up later today. I'm basically what I'm doing is I'm adding a package and including all the healings that I do into two easy packages, a basic one and then a divine one. And the divine one just includes the Akashic Record gift retrieval. So now when you get to my website, you're not overwhelmed with so many choices because I do have, <laughs> I did have a lot of options. So I'm just making a two now. So it's super, super easy. Okay. Um, I'm doing a video later on today and I'm going to explain it better for everybody, um, what it entails and everything. But basically all my videos that, um, that I post on Facebook get put into a group. After several days I delete that or I take them down and then just keep them there. So you would have access to these videos. Okay. So anyways, guys, let's go ahead and do your sacral. So if you have any sacral um, blockages or whatever, it's not open or it can be <clears throat> over-energized. If it's over-energized, you might um, notice that you really, really enjoy doing something in the bedroom. <laughs> um, if it's under... Um, open, if it's not open all the way or it's... There's not enough energy there. You can have reproductive organ pro problems. You can have, um, what are they, what are they, is it called? Intestinal problems as well, okay? Um, so the best thing to do is to go ahead and balance it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open, I'm gonna align it and balance it with your root. Okay, so hopefully you watched the video before um, on the root one. And I have been seeing that a lot of people are having root and sacral problems again. And I don't know if it's with the energy that we had like a couple weeks ago where it was so intense in the head that it just kind of like disembalanced everybody. So the best thing to do is to focus on. Um, you know, if you dance, you can open your root chakra that way or standing in water in a puddle outside. But you have to have the intention. You have to say, I'm going to dance so that I open, balance, and align my root chakra. And remember, you are the boss, so your body has to listen to you. Okay? You are in command of your body. So a lot of us just allow our bodies to do whatever the hell it wants. You know, but our body is designed to listen to us. Now, if we command it and we're firm about it, then it will happen. Um, when I started my mental um, journey of, of discovering things um, regarding to do with, you know, like the, the power of the subconscious mind and mental power and things like that, I read a book and it said that um, he had 20 years without even getting sniffles and that's because he command his body that he wouldn't get sick. So I did it then and that was about, hmm, well, almost four years ago that I did that. And then I started my, that actually kind of the reason why I started my spiritual awakening was after that. Um, and at the time I was given diagnosis that I wasn't going to be able to walk because my spine was uh, curved the opposite way. So your back is curved a certain way, mine was curved the other way. So I was told that um, I wasn't going to be able to walk 
and I was put on tramadol. Well, I was taking tramadol for the pain because it was unbearable. Uh, but I healed all past that. I said, I do not accept that. I'm moving on, and I cured myself. So for any of you guys that's going through something extreme, know that you can heal yourself. You just have to command your body, and your body will listen. Okay, so I'm sorry. Let's go ahead and get started on your sacral. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to use today the healing for this. So what I need you to do is to sit with your spine straight, your feet flat on the floor, making sure that nothing's crossed. Go ahead and close your eyes. I want you to visualize. That you're in a bubble with golden light. You're going to take a nice deep breath and you're going to inhale this golden, beautiful light. And you're going to exhale negativity, anything that you're ready to release. Okay, we're going to do this twice. So we're going to inhale, hold for two, and then now, and then we exhale. And on the exhale, I want you to focus it like if you're fogging a mirror. So I want you to put your hand in front of you and go, and that's how you're going to breathe out, okay? You're pushing everything out. This is a very cleansing breath. Okay, so, go ahead and inhale. Hold for one, two, exhale. Very good. Let's do it again. Inhale, hold one, two. There you go. Okay. So remain and keep your eyes closed. I'm going to put the intention in the video. Okay, so I call my higher self and your higher self, higher self of anyone watching this video across time and space, that they receive this healing for their highest and best and perfect comfort and alignment, exactly what they need at this moment in time. So it is... It is commanded that anyone watching this video open, balance, and align your sacral chakra. Removing any blockages that they're ready to release. And it goes into perfect alignment with the root chakra. Okay, so the sacral chakra is orange. And I always wondered why they named them navel oranges. They say it's because on the side it looks kind of like a navel, but maybe it has something to do with the chakra as well. So, okay. Now what I want you to do is we're going to do one more breath that I showed you earlier, and this breath is going to release whatever you released right now. I'm going to send it out. So inhale, one, two, hold, one, two, exhale. There you go. So guys, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you book a session. Now that it's super, super easy to book a session with me, I hope you do it. There's just two. There's just the normal one where you get all the healing that I have. And the second one is the same thing except for it just adds the gift retrieval session. Okay? And that's on my website to book where you can send me a message if you have any questions. Okay, guys. I love you. Have a great day. Namaste.